Before we go, as an Air Force veteran, I'm honored to help close this week's show in a different way with a Memorial Day tribute. And coming from a military family, I'd like to add that with so much happening in the world, we can't forget to take a moment and pay our respects to those in uniform who gave everything in service to this country. 35 years ago, President Ronald Reagan gave the Memorial Day message you're about to hear. We first brought you this tribute in 2021, but felt, especially this year, that it deserved to be seen once again. And so, with President Reagan's powerful words, we end our show today by saying thank you to those who paid the highest price. This Memorial Day, we remember with solemn pride and gratitude America's sons and daughters who have paid the ultimate price for the preservation of freedom. From the shot heard round the world that marked our birth as a nation, Americans have time and again taken up arms in liberty's defense. Knowing the ferocity of war and the immensity of the sacrifice it exacts, they have nonetheless followed the spirit of our founders who pledged their lives, their fortunes, and their sacred honor to the support of freedom. The debt we owe to those who have left home and family to serve this cause is beyond measure. But our greatest debt of all is to those who fell in battle. Their ranks are legion, the stories of their heroism countless. Many of them lie beneath the soil of distant lands, and many here at home. Their final bivouac may be a well-kept cemetery or an unknown unmarked field or lane or shore, but glory guards each one well. These heroes who fought with all the faith and valor that free men can muster. Oliver Wendell Holmes expressed a fitting thought when he said, at the grave of a hero, we end not with sorrow at the inevitable loss, but with the contagion of his courage. I join all of you who proudly share that spirit in your own service to our nation as you pay tribute to these brave Americans. May we always walk in the light of their memory, the light of liberty which shines from age to age and still illumines the way forward. God bless you and God bless America.